Hello guys, uh, today I come up with some interesting solution uh, related with the jQuery. So uh, you know all about like uh, what is the jQuery everything. So if you not, uh, please go through my previous videos to get all the ideas of uh, jQuery. So uh, you know this is the uh, basic library uh, to get uh, interact with the jQuery attributes, libraries, everything. So I added this one. So today my topic I want to uh, disable my button after clicked. So why I need this uh, solution uh, to cover here? See suppose uh, you have the form. So you if you uh, try to submit. Uh, server side uh, it takes like uh, some seconds to uh, post the data it means to uh, uh, add the data into the database so that time if user normally uh, want a data to be uh, fast uh, so they try to click two three times so multiple records uh, is possible to add in the table so uh, how to restrict this one so most of the website facing this issues so let me come up with the solution for this with simple uh, jquery uh, script ok fine uh, I just uh, going to add my button here input type button and I just set uh, id uh, something like uh, id btn ok value for my button I give submit fine so now my button is ready I going to write my script okay uh, so I just initialize my uh, function by using a document dot ready function Okay, now I want to do this uh, operation by click on a submit so I just take a click event of the button so uh, how we can uh, get it so by getting the ID as so ID button to call ID you have to use hash uh, character then oh, sorry uh, I just want to do the event for click ok click function ok once my uh, button click I want to disable my button so it's very simple process I just uh, go and take this button dot property disabled set true and uh, one more attribute I planning to add CSS not allowed so that a user feels that uh, something is happening here if you simply disable button get disabled but you will not see any user uh, friendly activities there so fine let me go and run the application again by using a deeper question yeah now you can see button got disabled 
once i uh, click uh, try to click the next time uh, it's showing like not the load symbol so i just uh, refresh and show you now button get uh, in a normal i try to click two to three times in the first click after once it's clicked it's got a uh, disabled plus it's got, uh, got a symbol not allow so this is very good uh, validation we can use and prevent the double click issues thanks for watching the video i'll come up with new solution in future videos